y'all. <clears throat> so welcome to another um, vlog, I guess. It's super early. It's 7.37 in the morning. And it is Sunday. <clears throat> so um, we don't stream service until about 12.15. So I have a couple of hours to get some things done. I do have some work assignments that I have to finish today. So like two and a half work um, assignments I have to finish today. And then I'm doing the laundry right now. I, I'm probably, after I drop the load off, I'm probably going to go ahead and go to Walgreens because I need some hair stuff and some face wash. So hopefully everybody's doing well. The weekend has just been amazing as far as the weather and the days go. We haven't really did a whole bunch of stuff. Um, we kicked it with our brother yesterday, um, my brother-in-law, my husband's brother. And we were just chilling around, playing beats, rapping and stuff like that. And it was really cool. It was really chill. Um, and we were so we were so proud of ourselves because with quarantine and everything that's been going on, we have been ultimate homebodies. Like, so we told ourselves we got invited out by our brother or whatever. And we were like, you know what? Let's go ahead and get out because we usually don't. And I'm usually like during the week, I don't usually go anywhere because I work from home. So usually on the weekends, it's usually the times where I'm like, okay, let me just get out the house, even if it is for an hour or two, or even if I am just going down the street to the store. I'm actually pretty hungry, but I have breakfast at home and I'm trying to manage my money better. So I don't know. I might have to get something quick. I don't know. But what I'll do is I'll go ahead and when I get done putting the laundry in, I want to wait until all the clothes are in the dryer and then go to Dunkin. I should cook you some breakfast. There. I want to see if he wants to go to this diner place. So we made it to the laundromat. I'm going to go ahead and get myself situated as far as all the stuff I have to bring in here. And I have my phone right here. So. Our clothes are washed, they're in the dryer. We have about 20 minutes. So I am going to run to Walgreens real quick and get me, and probably my husband, some coffee from Dunkin'. So we're gonna go into Walgreens real, real quick and hopefully I'll be able to find something. If I'm not able to find anything, I'll just, I'll just come back in. But anyways, here we go. Thank you for running on Dunkin'. Would you care to try a sweet cream cold brew today? Uh, no, thank you. Okay, can I just get two iced coffees with mocha, cream, and sugar? And then can I just get uh, two plain stuffed bagel minis? That's all. Seven eighty four. Thank you. Thank you. Anywho, so yeah, so oh, uh, y'all, I cannot believe I'm outside of Target right now. Like, I'm just gonna go in here. I'm just gonna take a gander around. I'm not gonna spend too much time in here. Guys, we're back from Target and of course I spent way too much money and I cannot spend any more money after this so I made it home and I want to go ahead and show you guys what I got from um, Target I really feel super bad because I feel like I spent way too much money but like I said before this is gonna be my one splurge for the month and it's all like it's not like just it's all like stuff that is like hygiene stuff whether it's for my hair my skin um my body it's like all of that stuff so i don't want you to think i went to target and i bought like a bunch of stuff that just didn't like benefit me it wasn't like home decor or anything like that but anyways so the first thing that i got i got some elderberry um immune gummies from dr formula these were on sale for about $11, which honestly, y'all, I never in my life would ever spend $11 on gummies or not gummies, but vitamins. 
but with everything that's been going on with me really trying to like me and my husband for us like we're getting I'm 30 my husband is getting ready to turn 30 in about two months so we've been really like taking our health um into consideration and just really trying to do things now so we can prevent you know um bigger problems or issues that might happen later on then I got some apple cider uh, vinegar tablets and my cousin was the one that was telling me about apple uh, apple cider vinegar um tablets this isn't the brand that she told me to get but i didn't feel like going anywhere um these were like 3.99 too the only thing that kind of bothers me a little bit is when you look at the other ingredients on here there is silica silica so i'm kind of like about that but i was like you know what i'm just gonna go ahead and try these and then next time when i do a splurge try to get another brand so then i ooh, i also got some as i am dry and itchy scalp care olive and tea tree um salicylic acid dandruff oil treatment and it's for hair types three and four so i've been i always um I've been needing some hair, um, some hair oil for my hair, but I do uh, tend to have like a little bit of like dandruff or like dry, itchy, um, flaky scalp from time to time. So, and I was in need of a regular just moisturize, moisturizer, conditioner, and I saw this new line at Target. I don't think it's 100% natural or organic or anything like that, but it's called Joyzy curls Josie curls and it's the moisturizing um conditioner and it has african extracts um plus bao bao boil bao i can't say that moringa and aloe vera and it's free from sulfates color colorants and parabens if you know me and if you've been watching my channel for a while i'm not one of those people who gets everything 100 organic everything 100 um natural i just try to do like the 80 20 type of thing it is for um detangling your hair and for sensitive scalp and it's paraben uh, well cruelty free and it's vegan so this is how it looks y'all and it was a 16 fluid ounce um bottle i think for like 4.99 so that's why i got it because i use a lot of conditioner then i got my holy grail head and shoulders um dry scalp care i was gonna try the they have like a new line that has like a bunch of like colors and designs on it but it was 8.99 so this was 5.99 i was like i'm just gonna get this because it all works the same so um i alternate with this shampoo and then just a regular sulfate free shampoo i still have some in the shower so that's why i didn't buy any because i'm like whatever and then i needed a deep um a strengthen and restore treatment mask so i got this and i'm just gonna go ahead and use that as my deep conditioner i'm gonna go ahead and start deep conditioning my hair at least once a week because i gotta get my hair back healthy y'all and i've done this before where my hair was super healthy and then i slacked off and then i got it back up to speed so i'm just gonna do the same thing again because i don't got time then i was in need of some face wash i did just go to the store um i went to walmart and i bought some face face wash from clean beauty um i just don't know how i feel about it um and it's my first time ever using it and it could be because i but i just started to break out even more and i don't know if it's just because it's a new product or if there's something that's in it or if it's just because it's around that time of the month but i'm just sitting here like I tried this before and it does say formulate it without parabens sls and silicone so just to let you know and then i found these in the uh target dollar spot and it's just some cleansing wipes they're a dollar i just think the design and the aesthetic is just so freaking cute they had different designs as well but it's for your phone your tablet your um, computer your glasses all kinds of like screens so i just got that because that's always necessary in my opinion then i got some more um they didn't have the usual mouthwash that i use but i just went ahead and got this i usually use this brand um or the tom's or the tom's brand but they didn't have all they had was the charcoal one but it does have coconut oil in it and if you guys don't know coconut oil is really good for oil pooling um so if you're not really sure what oil pooling is i'll try to put something um either on the screen or down below but it's to really like to get all of the toxins and things out of your body and you gargle with like coconut oil in your mouth don't swallow it though and then don't spit it down the drain because it can you know clog up your sink but spit it into like 
you know a trash can or some kind of bag or something like that so i got this and it says never tested on animals and it's extra freshening mouthwash with activated charcoal and coconut oil so i'll let you guys know i've tried the blue kind and the green kind of this brand so i always see this one and y'all now this is probably one of my favorite things that i bought and I, you guys are gonna be like why easter is right around the corner y'all and if i don't know if you guys know i love i love all holidays i love i love valentine's day i love easter i love um i love thanksgiving i love i even kind of like halloween the the nice part of it and of course i love christmas and i love birthdays that's like a little spiel about quiche so when i let me tell y'all target has a lot of cute easter stuff the aesthetic of it is so chic it's so like it's so i love it okay if you're the type of person who's looking to decorate your house but you don't want to do the cheesy like easter eggs and yellow chickens and bunnies and pink pastels colors go to target they have like a aesthetic for their um easter stuff and it's so chic and so freaking cute so let me show y'all the two pairs of Easter socks that I got. So I got these right here, which just look like this. Like, first of all, can we just talk about this detailing? Like, how cute is that? The aesthetic, bruh. And then I got this pair, which is kind of more like a neutral, like has like neutral bunnies on it. And as a grown woman who loves to wear like character socks and super colorful socks, which is something I've been doing since the seventh grade, honestly, um this is perfect for me because it's easter it's themed but it looks grown it looks it doesn't look like your typical happy easter which if that's what you into go ahead that's great i'm not knocking nobody but y'all i was really looking for some adult socks and i found these in the um target dollar spot okay one more bag at least i got some iced coffee i have tried this before years ago okay years ago but I just didn't too much like it. So I found out that they have a mocha cold brew coffee with almond milk and it's dairy free. So I was like, you know what? I'm just going to go ahead and try this because I'm so tired of spending $2 every time I go to Dunkin Donuts. So I was sitting here doing the math. This was $4.99 and it has 48 fluid ounces in there. And I know there's no way I'm going to be able to drink all of this in a week. And if I do a $2 drink for five days a week that is what is that twenty dollars per week and then add that up per month this is only five bucks so i'm hope i'm hoping that i'll be able to have a little bit more self-control um and it's also dairy free because i've been trying to be very mindful about my dairy intake because it tends to make me super congested so i'm gonna go ahead and end this video here i feel like it's super super late i cannot wait for the spring season i'm not really looking forward to allergies and bugs but i am looking for looking forward to warmer weather i'm already ready for fall honestly y'all but that's i always go through this every year like once fall passes and winter comes and then spring comes i'm like okay i'm ready for christmas <laughs> so i love y'all as always um if you guys